We would like to recognize the contributions and sponsorship of our outstanding community partners in the realization of our new scoreboard for Daryl Cott Field. Coach Cott was the longtime coach of the Eagles program who nurtured generations of young athletes, teaching them not only the skills of the game, but also his passion for the game of football. In the year 2000, we honored Coach Cott by renaming the old Eagles Airy Field in his honor. Today, we officially dedicate our new scoreboard in Coach Cott's memory for all that he did to keep football alive in our community. Representing the Cott family today is Coach Cott's wife, Lynn. The new scoreboard for our field would not have become a reality without the generous contributions of time, work, materials, and money from our community sponsors. We would like to recognize all of our sponsors and we ask that the representatives step forward when they are announced. First, former WCS Eagle star, CFL most outstanding lineman, Grey Cup champion, and current Denver Bronco, Brett Jones and the NFL Foundation. We are so happy to have Brett and his wife Amy here with us today. With the NFL season in full swing, we were expecting Brett to be represented by his mom or dad, but Brett unfortunately suffered an injury in the preseason, so he is home for a couple of weeks before his rehab starts up. Harborfront Wealth Management, represented by Eagles alumnus and current coach Chris Mickle. Suez Valley Industries, represented by former Eagle star Mike Bell. Jerry Manil Limited, which just celebrated its 60th anniversary in our community. Manil's is represented by Darcy McCormick. Prairie Lightning Electric, represented by Eagles alumnus Dan Goulash. A and B Concrete, represented by Bill Valbrecht. We would also like to mention Stewart Steel, Merglot Steel and Metals, and South Sask Rat Hole as sponsors to our new clock. First, the Saskatchewan Rough Riders and their Riders and Dream Community Fund and Weber's Old Prairie Sky Co-op were also part of this endeavor. And finally, the scoreboard would not have become a reality without the support and help of Rod Nevidomi and Ryan Fowler. Rod contacted many of our sponsors and helped organize much of the installation of the scoreboard, while WCS Principal Ryan Fowler provided financial and logistical supports for our project. And this project would also, or I should say, this introduction would be remiss without me also mentioning Coach Darren Abel, who put his shoulder to the wheel on a lot of this as well. Thanks again to all of our sponsors. The scoreboard will be a long-lasting legacy for our football program, our school, and our community. Thank you once again.